Hello, this is the part 2 of Infinite Penta tutorial. So, I've talked about the top bar and the layer modes and other things. So, now we're going to talk about this floating to go right here. Okay, first of all, you can move this around, you can attach it to the side, you can attach it to the side, you can attach it on top of here, or you can attach it below here or you can just keep it here I like to keep it here at the side floating so it is more accessible when I'm drawing so to make it more explainable to explain all these tools I'm gonna draw a frog so right here the first one we have um, paint okay and right here we have the plane mode and right here we have the erase mode razor and here we have the size and here we have the color and here we have the opacity okay let's go with the first button which is the paint mode so this is where you can get all the brushes that is available by default by infit panther there's a lot of brushes here and you can here you have the favorite panel which is where you're gonna add your favorite brush and you also can download brush right here you also can create your own brush and to add your favorite brush into the favorite panel is by just let's say pencil and you want hb pencil to be the favorite pencil so here you can see there's a selection here and you just tap on the heart and when it turns right it will be available on the favorite here and this is the basically the brushes that i usually use right here so that's how you um add your brushes to the favorites and how to customize your brushes let's say here hp pencil you just you, when you tap on hp pencil you will see the rename duplicate share reset and when you click on here there's the like setting and you just click on here and you will see the, how you can customize the size opacity the smoothness the size range the tilt function pressure and everything is here the offset so yeah basically i don't really touch this unless it is necessary so yeah so let's say here you're gonna talk about my favorite brush okay i use dry inker as my painting painting brush and the pilot paint I use my line art brush and the old pencil the old pencil as my as my um as my sketching brush so this is dry inker for painting in pilot paint is light art and lastly this is the old pencil all of these are default brush and i didn't customize it at all so basically you can just use it directly by at the brush panel and this is what I use as my sketch brush so this is the main three brushes that I'm using right now okay so right here we have the blend modes okay let's say we have um, blue and we have green and you want to blend it I will blend together like that and you have eraser mode erase you already know what is eraser eraser is to erase so and here you can change the size and angle and everything here you have paint 
you have your color palette you can add palette here here's your another setting for uh, HSB for the CMYK you have the eyedropper here and here you have the opacity okay so let's draw a frog So to draw a frog, I'm going to make like a circle. It doesn't have to be perfect. The eye. It's going to have a funky eye. Okay. And now, I'm going to delete this. Make it a bit cleaner and we're gonna make the eyes. We're gonna duplicate this. Make the mouth. And there you go. That's is that's our isn't it change it a little bit? We're gonna use this tort, make it a bit um Okay now we have the shapes. Now we're gonna do the drawing part. Oops. I'm gonna clean this a little bit. And now we're gonna put some color. I'm going to use the dry inker Color it Clean it a little bit This is a frog. <laughs> Merge this together and make a layer where I'm going to use the layer mode multiply and then I'm going to put it to 50 ish and pick the dark blue and I'm going to color it and clip it inside right there and another one with luminosity with the rate okay. and now we're gonna put overlay with 
with the purple turn down the opacity add yellow and then turn down the opacity And then here we go. We have the book. Oh wait, I forgot to make the white part right here. There you go. The frog. I'm going to touch it up a little bit with white I'm just going to fix this, fix this. I'm going to put some array overlay Opacity a little bit and at reach just a little bit just it higher and do the right right here to the side here. Lower the opacity, and there you go. That's our frog. Thank you for watching. I'll see you again in the next video.